clay jar, a copper cylinder, an iron rod, that's it. But put them together with an acidic liquid and you've got something weird, a 2,000-year-old battery. These objects found near Baghdad look simple. But when modern scientists copied them and filled them with vinegar or grape juice, they produced a small electric current. Now the big question, did ancient people actually use them that way? Some think they were used for electroplating, coating metal objects with a thin layer of gold or silver. A low steady current would do the job. Others say they were just storage jars and were overhyping them. The frustrating part? We don't have an instruction manual. No clear written text says, hey, this is our awesome portable battery. But if they were batteries, that means people in the ancient Near East understood enough about materials and reactions to harness basic electricity long before modern science. Not for iPhones, not for light bulbs, but for crafts, rituals, or maybe even experiments we'll never know about. So is the Baghdad battery real ancient tech, or a cool coincidence we're desperate to turn into a story? Until we find more proof, it sits in that creepy space between confirmed science and what if.